So what more will I get if I move up to 5D Embroidery Extra? Well, everything that you just saw is actually in extra. Okay. So you won't lose anything that you just, you know, that were those great features. Okay. But extra will give you a lot more. Now, remember when you first walked in, Julie? We yeah. took your picture. You took my picture as yeah. soon as I walked in. It's a little bit different because let's go ahead and I'm going to get rid of that design. And there's a new icon that's called the background wizard. Okay. So with the background wizard, I went ahead and I loaded your picture. Oh, there I am. That's it, <laughs> right there. And so look what happens when I click finish. There you are, oh my actually, goodness. right in the screen. Let's go ahead. Oh, there you are. Okay. With your hoop. There okay. I am with my hoop. <laughs> That's right. Now, let's go ahead and change the hoop size. Okay. And make it a little bit smaller. Zoom out just a little bit. Okay. You still have those zooming tools. I do. Okay. So I have both. So right. I can zoom down here or up the top. One of the really cool things about the Embroidery Extra is I can now move your background. Oh wow. So there you are. Okay. Moving around. But I'm going to bring this right down here. Now see, I've got the hoop just right on your garment. Yes. So we're going to design directly to your garment to make sure it's the right size and the look straight away. Oh, wow, that's wonderful. It is. It's really neat and it also helps me to choose the hoop, what size, everything. Colors. Colors. Exactly. Now, remember we did have the Express Design Wizard before. Okay. That With was in 4D? your 4D. Okay. Yep, that was in your 4D. What we're going to now do is take this to another level because let's this make great. a design. Directly for the size. It is. Wonderful. It is. It makes it really easy to work with. And let's go ahead. This design oh, that's is... that's pretty. Yeah, it's a real pretty little design. And click next. And I'm going to rotate it slightly. Now, again, you can do it all on screen. So now this okay. is going to come off your shoulder. Okay. And then next, I'm just going to kind of let the defaults go with this. Okay. Um, do you want to take get rid of all of the background? And notice there are a couple little spaces in here. So, okay. um, and again, going back to that Robus and Anton. Robus and Anton. Anton. Great. Yep. Thank you. Yep. So. And we are going to sew on a knit yes. because it is a sweater. Mm -hmm. And then just click next. The design is actually being digitized as we speak. Okay. So very quick, very easy. It's creating the objects and then creating the stitches. Wow, right that's there. beautiful. It turned out really fun. And there it is right there on your garment. And then I can actually move the design slightly. So you can move the background yeah. or you can move the design. That's correct. Okay. Yeah. So let's say I wanted this right in the middle and there is a new feature that is called center in hoop. So it'll put it right in the middle of the hoop. Great. Okay. So that way I can actually move my garment around a little bit. It's probably better that way. Okay. So let's go ahead and move that garment. So I'm going to bring it up to your shoulder just okay. a little bit more. Right. So zoom out. And now let's really see what it's going to look like by choosing one of the 3D view modes. So let's go ahead there. Oh and there my it is. goodness, that's wonderful. So that's your new design. Wow, right there. Oh, that's great. So now that you're ready to with the design and you know exactly what it's going to look like, let's go ahead and even do a print preview because that will allow you to see right in the design what it's going to look like, how it's going to be on your garment, all of that. And with a grid too, that's great. Yep, so you can see exactly where it's going to be. So those are some of the really great features about Embroidery Extra. Wow!